Josh, did you know there are 170 million birds living in the UK? That's so many. What if they peck at my wiring or cause hotspots? Josh, I keep telling you, you're not a solar panel. I can be anything I want to be, Charlie, and so can you. I'm Charlie. I'm Josh. And today we're going to be talking about how to protect your solar panels from birds and other animals. When it's necessary to do so. And how much it will cost you roughly. And we're Sunsafe. We offer Sunsafe Plus, the UK's first solar subscription, which comes with no upfront cost and means you can pay a fixed monthly payment. And if you want to find out more about Sunsafe Plus, you can skip ahead because we talk about it later on in the video or click the link down below. Let's go. Josh, why does anyone need to bird proof their solar panels? Well, birds and particularly pigeons love the warm, welcoming nature of a solar panel and love to build their nests under them. That does sound lovely. It would be except for the five terrible things that birds do. Number one, they excrete on your panels. This reduces the amount of sunlight that your panels can turn into electricity, which would be bad enough, except the excretions also cause horrible splotches which can cause hotspots. What is a hotspot? So this, funnily enough, has the same effect as permanent shading. Basically, a solar panel is made up of loads of individual solar cells, and if you cover any of them, it can cause a hotspot, which in turn can cause the panel to melt or burn. This is because it increases the electrical resistance, the glass can crack, and the electrical systems within can be damaged. Sounds bad, all that permanent damage just from bird poo. Exactly. And that's not all. Birds' excretions contain uric acid, which can wear away the anti-reflective coating on your panels, which can reduce their efficiency. What a crappy situation. Charlie, what's the second terrible thing that birds can do when they nest under your solar panels? They peck at your wiring. They peck at your electrics, they peck at the panels, they peck and peck and peck. That sounds dangerous to you and them. It is. It can cause you hundreds or thousands of pounds in repairs, especially if you need scaffolding. It can also cause you reduced energy bill savings and reduced revenue from export income because damage wires will affect your solar panel's output. Why do they love to peck your wires so much? Well, there are two theories. The first is that they think the wires are twigs that they could break apart and put in their nests. The second theory, genuinely, is that they think they might be shiny beetles that they can eat. Wow, silly birds. Josh, what's number three? Noise! Birds call to each other a lot, especially in the morning, and this can be extremely annoying, especially if you maybe want to get some sleep. And also, particularly if you have a sleeping baby, it can feel like punishment from above. Number four is rooftop carnage. When birds are making nests on your roof, they may end up leaving all the aforementioned excrement and nesting materials, and it could end up clogging your gutter and looking pretty disgusting. They won't actually destroy your roof though, right? Oh, you sweet summer child. When birds are building nests, they sometimes drop stones from a height, which could crack your roof tile, and if birds take an interest in that, they could keep pecking at it, break it completely, and break into your nice warm roof space. Which leads us neatly on to number five. All of these illicit activities can attract other animals, such as squirrels, rats, mice, and insects. It's all one big animal party, except you're not invited. Josh, what kind of stuff do these other animals do to solar panels? Well, squirrels will chew on anything to keep their teeth short, and wires are perfect for that. And hornets and wasps will, horrifyingly, build nests under... nests? Beehives. Hives. Under your panels, and that can mess with their ventilation system and generally provide a very threatening presence. Like and subscribe. subscribe. Josh, is there no end to this awfulness? No solutions to this scourge of birds and other animals? There are actually multiple solutions. Oh, wonderful. Please tell me all about them. Well, one option is to get plastic or stainless steel spikes. You can put these around your solar panels, or more realistically, get your installer to do it. These can prevent birds from nesting under your panels, and if well installed, they can last as long as your solar panels. For more on solar panel lifespans, check out our article. The link is in the video description. And what about netting or mesh? I feel like I've seen people with solar panels using that as well. Yes, you can absolutely use plastic or wire mesh to protect your solar panels. It all depends on what your installer has and recommends. And what if I wanted to go with something a bit fancier? Well, you can add plastic skirts to the edge of your solar panels, often in the exact same colour as your panels. But this is usually the most expensive option. Sounds a bit like when you put plastic skirts around a Christmas tree to stop your cat chewing on it. Yes, exactly. Except in this case, the skirts will block the animal's entry completely instead of turning it into a fun, winnable game that ends with your cat throwing up plastic. 
Are there any cheaper options to protect my panels? Well, it'll usually cost you more in the long run to not adequately protect your panels, but if you're insistent, you can go for less conventional options, such as reflective tape, scare balloons, and plastic birds. Sorry, I have a few questions. That's fair. All of these have varying levels of effectiveness, so while they occasionally may be useful, we would not recommend them. Also remember to keep your garden clean and your outdoor bins tidy and not overflowing as this may also attract birds and other animals. And those are all your options. Hang on, don't some people play really high frequency noises to repel birds? Yes, they do, but they don't work because birds can't hear them. Humans can actually hear a higher frequency of sound than birds, or most birds, including sparrows, starlings and pigeons. Go humans! Uh, right, I think it's time we talk through Sunsay Plus, the UK's first solar subscription. Yeah! Sunsay Plus is the UK's first solar subscription and it is designed to unlock solar for millions of households in the UK. With Sunsay Plus, you can switch to solar with no upfront costs. All you have to do is pay a fixed monthly fee for 20 years. And it does stay absolutely fixed. No sneaky price rises, so you are fully protected against inflation from energy bills. You will immediately start saving on your energy bills and you will also earn income for exporting excess electricity to the grid. And these combined savings could exceed your monthly payment to Sunsave, which means you actually earn money each year despite paying a subscription. This means you don't have to wait years for payback, which is what most people have to do when they buy solar upfront. Your best in class solar and battery system will also be protected by the Sunsave guarantee, which provides total peace of mind that your system will produce clean green electricity for the duration of your subscription without you having to raise a finger. The Sunsave guarantee includes free replacement parts, including a battery and inverter, 24 seven monitoring and maintenance, comprehensive insurance provided by Aviva and downtime cover. Sunsafe Plus is built to be flexible, so you're in charge of your subscription. Therefore, you can make a full or partial early repayment at any point without incurring any fees, charges or penalties. You also legally own your system from day one, which means that you will earn 100% of the export income. We don't take a cut. Sunsafe Plus also doesn't require a roof lease or airspace lease, which have historically caused problems with mortgage providers in the past. To learn more about Sunsafe Plus, head to our website, sunsafe.energy. There you can read way more about our subscription, watch interviews with people who already have it and sign up yourself. Okay, Charlie, I understand the dangers that birds pose and how to guard against them, but how much will protecting my solar panels from birds all cost? Good question. If you get bird protection installed when you get solar panels installed, it will usually add a few hundred pounds to the total cost, but it's well worth it. What if I decide to get it later on? Well, that isn't a great idea because you have to pay for scaffolding all over again, which isn't cheap. So how do I know if I need bird proofing? Well, it all depends on how many birds you have in your area. So go outside, look at the sky, look at the trees, or find a neighbour with solar panels and ask them if they've had problems with birds nesting underneath. What if I don't have any neighbours with solar panels or any neighbours at all, and I'm still sitting on the fence? Well, Josh, fence sitting is painful, literally and financially. We would always recommend, if you're not sure, to get the bird protection installed when you get the panels installed, because regressing it later is pretty expensive. Josh, asking for a friend, what should I do if I already have birds nesting under my solar panels? If you're thinking of removing or damaging a nest that's under your solar panels, stop. The Wildlife and Countryside Act of 1981 bars anyone from removing or damaging a nest that's in use or being built. So, if you do so, you could face an unlimited fine or up to six months in prison. They're gonna cart me off to the big house. Please don't let them get me. Charlie, calm down. All you need to do is not touch the nest and wait. Once you're absolutely sure that the nest is inactive and that the chicks and the parents have left and are long gone, you can remove the nest. So is it worth getting solar panel bird proofing? If you think birds may nest under your panels, then yes, absolutely. Bird proofing can last as long as your solar panels do and save you from hundreds or even thousands of pounds of damage. And if you're not sure? Well, I'd say speak to your neighbors about their experience and primarily get a good installer like Sunsafe. They'll give you the right recommendation. Obviously, we've done a whole guide on solar panel bird proofing and the link is down below. On our site, you can also explore our Solar Advice Hub and sign up for Sunsafe Plus, the UK's first solar subscription. Please subscribe to our channel for a continual stream of really wonderful solar panel videos. Bye!